Legend of Total War here with part 2 of my Medieval 1 Total War uh, campaign as the uh, Danes. Now, last time I conquered Saxony, actually the last time was the first episode, so I conquered uh, Sweden, Norway, and Saxony. And um, the, the Holy Roman Empire hasn't put up a fight, they've just sort of stuck their men there. They retreated back to the fort. Now I could go and attack it. But it's only going to take two years for it to fall, so I might as well just starve them out. Um, in that time... Ah, oh, shit. Not good uh, public order there. I've also got a new king. Doesn't really help that much. Um, I'll need this guy there as well. Shit, that's not good. Yeah, my new king isn't quite as good as the old one, so... Gotta lower the tax rates. Which fucking sucks. Can't lower that any further. Two percent chance isn't much to worry about. Eh. Whatever, I need that guy out of there. I'll build a fort here now. Let's see. Okay, so a thirteen percent chance of rebellion. Fingers crossed. Shouldn't happen, but it's not unheard of. Um, aside from that, spending money. Can't build anything here until that fort has fallen. But here, I should build... Um, more... Uh, let me see. Actually, I'll wait a turn, because I'm not going to be able to afford that. But that's what I'm going to get next. In fact, maybe I'll do that before this. Because then I can afford it. Good, no rebellion, that's what I wanted to see. Actually, this guy here... Yeah. Needs to go back to... Bloody Denmark. Good, sorted, sorted. Better. Can go up. Yeah, 1% chance is nothing. Same with that. Good. Alright, well that's sorted. So here then, uh, just need to starve them out. It'll take two more turns until I've got it. One more turn. They're not putting up much of a fight. Which I'm not going to complain about, but still. Um, let's see. One more turn, I suppose. But I could build something here, I suppose. Something that doesn't cost much, maybe. Like, uh... Like that, I suppose. Good, Saxony's mine now. I didn't even lose a single man doing so. Normally, I don't starve them out, but... There's, there was no point in doing it. Um, I wasn't going to be able to move out straight away anyway. Now, these guys. Let's have a look who's going to be the best governor. This guy is, I think. He's not very pious, though. But I've never really valued piety to be a good trait. Alright, let's see how much it goes up by. 155 and 89 cost. So that went down, but this went up. Not really a very good trade. Um, maybe in time it'll sort itself out, though. Probably because this guy has low dread. Yeah, income will sort itself out. Uh, fairly badly damaged region. Need more Vikings. Actually, I should be getting all my Vikings from from Norway because they gain a 1 plus Valor bonus from here. So this is where I'm going to start pumping out my... Uh, my Vikings. Now let's see. This region here has low farming income, I'd say. But that doesn't mean it's not worth purchasing it, just means it's gonna take a while before I make any money out of it. My income at the moment is at two nine seven, which is shit. 
still fucking shit. Uh, I'll build the salt mine. It's going to increase my income by 26 florins, but doesn't cost much to build. And over time, it will become a value. Especially since it's early in the game, and provided I don't lose the region. And it gets destroyed. Which is every possibility that will happen. Still can't tax it to the max. Can tax this up a bit, though. Not that it makes any sort of difference. What happened here? Oh, fuck. Don't know why he's got the bad traits. Not too bad. Alcoholic's not good, but it doesn't really seem to do anything. Wait a sec. Yeah, it does. Ah, uh, I see. It's because... It's because I quit for the day and then came back, and then it readjusts it when I load. Right. I see. So, I'm sure that's something that was fixed with the patch. Oh well, I don't have it, so who cares. This isn't a challenge or anything, I'm just trying to have some fun. Play an old fucking game. Let's see. I've got no money, so there's not much point in doing anything. Okay, so that was constructed. Good tax right now. Oh, it doesn't really make a big difference. I would like to tax it more though. Hmm, maybe if I build the trading post, that'll help. Wait, can I even afford it? No. Okay, so the you know, there he is, he gets his one Valor bonus. Of course, this guy's a piece of shit, but whatever. Send him on his way to Saxony. He'll get there in like four turns. And then purchase another one in the meantime. And actually, my army here is... It's okay, and there's nothing in Brandenburg. No army. What if I was to get my king? And, let's see... The king and some loyal bodyguards. Just a couple. Into Brandenburg. Let's take this shit. Okay. And this guy needs to be married. Improve his loyalty. Which is not that great. Could be better. Last thing I want is a civil war. Which I do remember happens. Now, okay. Tax is bordering being not okay, but that's fine. Should get better in time, as long as... The longer I hold the region, the better. Now, I think I'm going to build the... Actually, I'm not going to be able to afford to build anything, so forget it. Yep, they gave up, and I got some money. That's good. Let's see. This guy needs to keep on coming down. Still not enough. I could afford to build this, I think. Actually, no, that would be the best thing to build. Even though the, um, it'll take, I think it takes 18 years for that to become worth building. But still, I've got like 320 turns left to go. It's very hard to blitz this game in like fucking 10 turns. In fact, it's impossible. Oh right, I forgot to assign a governor here. Oh shit, I could have had a rebellion there if I hadn't been careful. Fuck. They just retreated. They didn't even bother with a with the siege. Okay, we're gonna need someone to take over. 
Let's have a look. So far, it's all pretty shit. What about you? No, you're you're really shit. I think the best guy was him. He's not very loyal though. Hopefully it improves loyalty. It didn't, but the income went up. So that's the main thing. I'm going to need to shove a few more troops. Specifically peasants, I think, over here. Yep, that's got that sorted, and that's okay as well, so that's good. Keep them coming, the uh, Vikings. In fact, I'm pretty sure I can recruit Vikings here. I'll retrain these guys. Since I'm here. And... What will I build here? I've already got the copper mine, so that's good. Uh, a church would be good for public order. But then again, that'd be good for money. Uh, but it's about affordability. Church would be better, I think. That way I can up the taxes. Okay. Still okay. Oh, that's borderline. Same with that one. Still the same here as well. Borderline happiness there. Could use a church, but I need to be able to keep first. And that's not a priority just yet. Okay, I just built the uh, the keep here. I need to build Admiralty. Oh, Shipwright, sorry. That'd be good because then I can start building ships and then push them around all over the place in order to get trade income. Let's see. Gonna need to hold on to this, um, the garrison here for a little while longer. And there's not much else I can do, I suppose. My income is sitting... Eh, it's getting better. Which is good, because uh, so is my army. I keep getting shit generals. Oh, shit fucking commanders. Someone with high acumen and high dread would be good for me. I could fire this fucking asshole. Whoa, hang on. He's okay again. That's because he became a builder. What the fuck? Are his... Abilities just random or something, or is it that one became effect? Maybe it takes a little while for it to come into effect. That's at six. I don't get it. Well, it's good that they've got steward because um, that increases farming income. So you definitely don't want to fire someone that's got steward, not unless they're really fucking shit and everything else. I don't have much money. I've got 800 to kill. What have you got for me? Could purchase that, but it wouldn't increase my income by much. What the fuck happened here? Surely that's not got nothing to do with it. Maybe there's just a famine or something. Good thing I caught that. Make sure everything's okay. Um, I'm sure on the next turn it'll sort itself out. But I will purchase... Uh, let's see. I'll purchase a port. I think that'd be the best thing to buy. I can only just afford it too. Actually, probably not. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, nope. Good, it purchased the, the boat and not the unit. That's what I would have preferred. Not the boat, the fucking sh uh, shipwright. Port! That's what it is. Sorry for yelling. Heh. <laughs> Not really. I'm still fucking broke. Yeah, everything back to normal now. Sometimes you gotta babysit these fucking regions because you never know when they're gonna chuck the shits with you.
All good. Moving on again. Getting a bit of income. Watching the years roll on by. Trying to get things sorted. Oh, peace. Peace is for the weak and for fucking women. Not really, but still. I'm not sexist. Women can go to war too. Good. Getting some income there now. Probably because I built the church. Now what? That would only take two years. A uh, trading post would be good too because I'm about to get some ships. I'll be able to ship off uh, grain and linen off around the world. Though it will take a little while for that to happen. I can't afford it anyway. I can't afford that. I can only afford this, so that's what I'm going to get. Alright, moving on. Got myself some more troops. Soon I'll be able to just um, switch them around everywhere because I'll have ports. I think I'm just going to get... If I do most of my battles auto-resolved, then I'll just keep pumping out Vikings. I mean, they're really good early type troops. So... I got no problem with spamming them. Okay, what do I want? Lots of longboats, because I'm not expecting to go to war at sea too much. Not yet, anyway. Okay, they've got a bit of an army sitting here. The Germans. But it depends what they've got, so maybe I should build this. That'll give me some insight as to what they've got. I got another princess. It's good because this asshole could use a wife. Let's see. I've got 600 to kill. Oh, hang on. This takes priority. Good. Sitting on five regions. Still. Okay. Pump that up to very high. Actually, might, what might be good is if I... Oh, hang on. Might be over my head there trying to attack that. Oh, wait. Hang on. I can see what they've got. Alright. Mostly ballista. Well, two lots of ballista. Spearmen and peasants. Crossbowmen and a general. Not great. Won't bother sending in my peasants. That's what the Vikings are for. That guy's not too bad. Let's see. You don't want to send to war somebody that could actually be of use. So this guy's useless. Send him. He's near useless. I'd like him to have at least four acumen. Yeah, he's useless. Why not? Send him in. Oh, we can't leave too many of them in here, though. Come on, make a decision. Send that guy back. What have they got over here? Mostly Ballista and Peasants. In fact, that's pretty fucking weak. It's so weak that I think I should invade it. Alright, we'll see how that goes. Hey, look at that, they're fucking cowards. Alright, they actually want to fight. Uh, it's... I would fight it manually, except that 
manual battles are fucking glitched at the moment. Well, not glitched, but it causes my game to crash. And I don't think I'm going to have too much trouble. See? Fucking nothing. And I got some ransom off that. Fantastic. And it's ordered. That's good. Ah, I took control of both regions. Completely. So that's really good. How's my income looking now? 868, so something was worth taking. Ah, shit. Gonna need to get someone over there. Probably from over here. The peasants, maybe. Good. Now it's sorted. And I'll need someone to send someone back for retraining. Switch him around a bit. That's good. That's a good number for retraining. Alright, how's that ship coming along? It's getting there. Alright. Now, if I wanted to now, I can... Oh, no, I need the boat there first, of course. Actually, I'll probably need both, uh, two lots of boats. Uh, all right. Need to, uh, probably need to build a fort here. And assign a governor. Let's see. Who's at least half decent? Uh, you've got lots of dread, but not much acumen. So you'd be good for a region that's got fucking shit income like this. Garbage income. Alright, you can be the governor of Friesland. Let's hope the loyalty, loyalty, uh, fucking loyalty goes up. Good. Not too bad there. And the income went up by a little bit too. And look, you can be married to one of these bitches. Alright. What I should do here is also build a port so that I can build more ships. Because not, not not much else to build there, I suppose. Uh. Alright. Other governor. Let's see. No, you're shit. Uh, you're the best I've got. Which doesn't say much. Still, I think I might just leave it for a turn. <laughs> Alright, well, let's see. Things are looking pretty good so far. It's been about... Uh, 50 years into the game and so far I've got let's see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 hang on 3 plus 4 7 regions so far so that's that's pretty good progress my income is now at 767 getting there so I'll end the video there so like and subscribe part 3 is next and don't forget to visit me on Facebook and if you want um, go on and let me know what other kind of series you want to be seeing regular let's plays with uh, because I'm not doing any challenges for the time being because I've still got to do my other challenges as in the videos which I keep putting off because they take forever anyway I'll see you next time